What I am going to say, you may not like. It may not be too popular, but hey, I don't have a church. I don't tell you to tithe, to do, you know, so <laughs> what can I lose by saying this? And I am not trying to be rude or anything like that. I think in some churches, or maybe it was before, maybe in some churches now, they are very careful with what they say because I guess they may be afraid of people leaving their church and I guess some pastors may be afraid of losing money. I don't have a church, <laughs> so what can I lose? <laughs> okay. You may not like what I am going to say, but please listen. It is wrong to have sex before marriage, right? It is wrong. Yes, we all make mistakes. But the thing I don't like if a woman and a man are unmarried and have a baby, okay, it is okay to support the baby. But I think in some cases, they, I think some people celebrate the woman and the man like saying congratulations like like i think in some cases some people may throw them a party for having a baby unmarried if i were to kill someone let's say i killed 10 people in one day and I put up like a, a post, hey, I killed 10 people in one day. And let's say some people say, Kevin, that is amazing. We are going to throw you a party. You are going to get a Porsche, a Bugatti. We are going to give you some Jordan shoes, which I believe they are worthless, honestly. We are going to give you an iPad. Like, since you did that wrong thing, let us celebrate you. Ah. Uh, a person is unmarried. They have a baby. You throw them a party. Aren't you celebrating sin? Okay, help the baby. But I believe not to say you should like insult people and whatever else like that, but I think if people do that, they need to be corrected. Why would you give a person a party when they did something wrong? Kevin, you got fired at your job and because you cursed out your boss and other people, we are going to give you $100,000. Why? What I did was wrong. Why should I get benefits for doing something wrong? Yes, God give us grace. God can forgive us, but I believe one of the reasons more and more people, I believe, are having babies out of marriage because I think one of the reasons because it is not really seen as a bad thing now. 
I think some people call themselves a family because they lived together for so many years. That is strange. That is strange. Do you understand what I am trying to say? You may not like what I am saying, but I will never celebrate a woman or a man that have a baby out of marriage. I am not going to tell them congratulations on sinning. Congratulations on doing what is wrong. Hey, what you did is wrong and you need to change that. Which I think if you were to tell that to many people, they would probably think you are picking on them. Why? Because I think because doing evil stuff like that is not really seen as evil. I guess from for many people. It's like this world is being turned upside down. Now homosexuality is very normal. I remember back when I was a kid, maybe I did not know what to look for, I guess, back then. But back when I was a kid, I saw few, few homosexuals. Like, it was seen as a horrible thing back then. Like, it was, you know, if you were gay, like, I don't think too many people would openly expose it, at least where I am from. But as the years pass by now, it's like, so bad, I think, man. And also, you know, I was talking about one thing, but let me talk about this here. Also, what I have been seeing is like more and more of these younger guys out here. I think it is, it is more popular, I guess, for them to have long hair and tighter clothes, like having like a woman-like look like i think having for a man to have more of a woman like look i think that is popular now what is going on like having like real long hair for a man long hair down their back or tied up you know like back around my time like, I think some men had long hair, but the way they do it nowadays, like, they would see that as, like, really strange, I believe. It's like, I would say the world is being turned upside down. Listen now, and you can get mad at me if you want to. It is wrong for a man and a woman to have a baby out of marriage. It is wrong. I don't care if your mom, your dad, your cousin, or whoever throw you a party and say congratulations and all that mess there. It is wrong. It should not be celebrated. Yes, love the child. Yes, help out the child because it is not the child's fault. But I believe the woman and the man, if it be possible for you to do so, should be corrected. Some people may not know this. Maybe they are doing it out of ignorance. Stop throwing them parties. If you are doing so, stop. Giving them hugs, like, oh, good job. You know, like, as if they did a good job. Like, what is going on? I hope this makes sense. You may get mad at me, which I don't want you to stay mad at me. 
you know, I don't want you to start thinking bad thoughts and stuff like that to sin. But um, yeah, let me stop here. Please change that. Don't see it as, oh, I would never go to a party to where a couple is not married and they had a baby and they throwing a party for that. I would never go. I don't care how much free food they have. I don't care how much steak and chicken and ribs and all that stuff they have. I would never go. I like steak, though. Let me stop here. God bless you.